Hey guys, this is Naveen here. Welcome back to Naveen Automation Lab. So with this video, we are going to start a new series on different tools, installation and the configuration. What is the need of this? The need of this, why? Because a lot of people are struggling to installation because the practice will come later. Before that, you have to install, you have to configure certain tools until configuration you have to do in your Windows machine or in your Mac machine or sometimes in Linux machine also. So I was getting a lot of emails that maybe my JV, uh, JDK is not working and how to set up the JDK, how to set up Maven, what is the latest version of TestNG that we have to use, how to set up Cucumber with Ruby, Java and all such things, how to set up Postman, can you give me some at least basic installation video. All the videos are already available in my playlist but could be possible that those videos are maybe outdated and there are new versions are available, new configurations are available, new setup that you have to do. Uh, different environment variables you have to set up in your uh, windows and the mac machine respectively so there are a lot of uh, changes happened from last couple of years so i thought of uh, preparing a complete list not the entire course where we just talk about only and only the installation and the configuration and one basic example of that particular uh, tool or that particular library that you are using it for example let's see we are going to start with the java jdk 216 All right we are not going to talk about jdk less than 7 We'll talk about okay JDK 8, JDK 11, JDK 16, 15, what exactly you need, how to install, what are the different JDK packages are available, how to configure that, I think uh, that's very much needed, we will be doing it. Then you need Python, a lot of people they were asking I want Python 2 and Python 2 is already available in my system that I want to upgrade to Python 3, that how to do that. Ruby and Rails, TestNG, JUnit, Cucumber, Cucumber with uh, Ruby also we are going to talk about, we will take one example with Cucumber Ruby as well. Then how to set up Jenkins, what are different uh, various uh, ways of setup Jenkins, installation of the Jenkins, Docker, Kubernetes, and then some editor tools like Eclipse, IntelliJ, uh, Visual Studio Code, PyCharm, and the Selectors Hub also we will talk about. And some of the features that we will talk about on Selectors Hub on Google Chrome or different browsers, how to use them, how to get the XPath uh, CSS, and how to create your own custom uh, locators with the help of Selectors Hub, we will be doing that. Then I was uh, thinking that, okay, let's try with the Selenium Java, at least one example for the setup and the configuration point of view. Selenium with Java, Selenium Python, a lot of people, they are struggling that, okay, I want to start Selenium with C Sharp, but how to install C Sharp, right? What are the different configurations I need for Selenium with Ruby, right? How to, especially with the APM also, how to do that, how to install APM uh, on Windows machine or, uh, or uh, Mac machine. Then we have JMeter, Gatling, then we have different uh, different tools are available in the market like WebDriver, IO, Cypress, Test Project, Catalon, Robot Framework, Playwright, Puppeteer or maybe we can add later on some more products also over here, more uh, libraries also we can add it. Then some uh, API automation point of view or API testing point of view, we have Postman, Rest Assured, HTTP Client, Jersey Client, OK HTTP, Insomnia and the GraphQL and there are a lot of other uh, third party libraries are available, we can add it over here. Then different uh, configuration with respect to build automation like Maven and Gradle, Node.js, how exactly we're going to configure those things with respect to Java, with respect to uh, Node.js, with respect to, or maybe some other programming language that we are going to use that, we will see that. Then there are certain uh, uh, project management and source code management tools like Git repository, Bitbucket, uh, Zira, TestTrail, that also we can talk about it here. And then different clouds, how to set up at least a basic cloud and then basic execution with respect to test automation. What are different preconditions and the uh, configuration that are required? Let's see, you really want to set up one Dockerized grid. How will you do that? What do you mean by VNC viewer? What is a Docker composer and all such things? We can simply, we can talk about with respect to the installation, configuration and one basic example, we can take it. After that, the complete series is available, courses are available. Then you can uh, go through it with different blogs, with different YouTube videos, different YouTubers that you can follow like that. Okay. And then we have certain things with respect to, uh, you know, uh, Kibana, Grafana, MySQL, Oracle, Zamp, uh, Spring Boot, that also we can do that. And here in the first list, I have added, let's see, Docker and Jenkins also. A lot of people, they are struggling Docker on Windows machine. How to set up, what is the best way of installing Docker on Windows and Mac machine? We will do those things as well like that. So guys, this is whatever came in my mind, I just written over here. If you feel that, okay, yeah, this will be a really helpful series only for the installation part. I'm not talking about that, okay, we are going to talk about test project completely or Catalan completely, no. How to set up, how to installation and one basic example. If the existing video is already there, I'll add that video in the same playlist so that you don't need to, I don't need to prepare the video again and again like that. If whenever in future also, whenever 
let's see any updates are happening with respect to a specific uh, library or tool i'll try to uh, update that video or maybe create a new video in that case and then upload it over there and add in the same playlist so that you don't need to go anywhere it's a single playlist will work throughout the year and for upcoming thus all the videos will be there in the same playlist whenever you okay i want to use uh, let's see maven how to configure it you don't need to go to different blogs or youtube channels simple go to this particular playlist go to maven install maven by navin automation labs the search it you will just directly get into this particular playlist and then just configure it let's see after 2 years and after 1 year also after 6 months also in 2022 let's see if any new updates are happening or something some special configuration that we have to do that we will i'll be doing okay and then i'll be upgrading that particular version and then i'll prepare a new video and then add in the same playlist over here i hope it's really really helpful because a lot of people they are struggling i want to start robot framework but i'm not able to set up properly i want to start with cypress but i'm not able to set up properly i want to start with webdriver io but i'm really struggling to install the webdriver io on windows machine so in that case what are the different configurations and everything i think that will be a great it playlist and if you really want to add some more things whatever it's coming in your mind guys feel free to tell me in the comment section i'll definitely try to add it over here if i'm not aware of that particular tool also definitely i'll try to do some research on that tool how to install how to configure and at least one basic example i'll try to give it to you guys so please add in the comment section whatever is coming in your mind with respect to testing with respect to uh, development which is required for uh, testing or qa point of view feel free to add it over there whatever things came into my mind i just prepared the list and then on the basis of that uh, i'll be working on it if any existing video is already there in my playlist and i see okay there are no changes there is no point to prepare a new video for that i simply add that video in that playlist and then i'll share the link with you guys and then you also share with others so that people will get to know that yeah these are the a uh, different installation things are required for a specific tool and then you will find all the requirements and installations everything in the single playlist video that's it okay so that's all for this particular video guys i hope you liked it and for lastly i would like to thank to mukesh odwani he actually gave me this idea yesterday that why don't we create something like this so thanks mukesh for doing uh, giving this idea subscribe to the channel and share this video with others a lot of good things are coming so this is just a side uh, series other than that there are a lot of other uh, new series also i'm going to start very soon till then take care and god bless you all